Hello, I'm Kelsey Haynes and welcome to LTV News. In this episode, we'll take a look at Cubs fall comedy show starring Impractical Jokers star Sal Volcano. With more on the story, here's Nancy Bound. Hello, my name is Nancy Bound and I'm reporting live in front of Kendall Hall, where comedian and Impractical Joker Sal Volcano will take the stage in just a few moments. We're here to interview some of the people that have come to the show tonight. My first reaction when I found out oh, Sal was coming here, I was filled with joy. I love Impractical Jokers. My roommate came into my room and told me that Sal was coming, and I was like, yeah, I'm getting there three hours early. I'm not getting any work done that day. So we found out through Katie on our email, and we were all so excited, and we DM'd our CAs and asked them if they could cancel our mandatory training, and they did. My reaction when I found out Sal was coming was, my dad is going to be so jealous, and he is. I, I kind of couldn't believe it, because like Sal, he's a big deal, so I really I had to read the post twice. My reaction was just genuine excitement. I mean, everyone knows the semester can be rough, so it's pretty exciting to have somebody like Sal come over. I watch the show all the time, and Sal is actually my favorite of the four, so this is really exciting. Even though Sal is my least favorite Joker, I do love him, you know, he's just hilarious, his mannerisms and all that, and I do love watching the show almost every night, you know, Thursdays, new episodes. I feel like Sal is the perfect fit for coming to TCNJ because he matches the energy that TCNJ gives off. Yeah. Hysterical, funny, high energy. They're pretty local, a few hours away in New York. Um, most of their episodes are set there, and people here especially are very familiar with him, so I think that's, he's a great fit. Um, I think the turnout speaks for itself. I just passed the end of the line. They ran out of tickets, so it's like gonna be a full house tonight. I thought Sal would be a good fit for TCNJ because during the summer uh, we did a little questionnaire on Instagram, sort of gauging uh, what people's interest was, and one of the responses was the Impractical Jokers. So I thought Sal would be a, a great fit, especially since he was doing stand up. If Sal was watching this right now, I'm right over the bridge. Wait, he's from Staten Island, right? Yes. He's from Staten Island. I'm from Perth, and boy, right out. Like, Come hang out. Right. You know, like over the bridge, 440, you know what I'm talking about. Our bridge crossing. Uh, Thank you. Thanks. I would say, Sal Volcano, you are my favorite Impractical Joker and just my favorite celebrity in general. So, I love you. Sal, if you're watching this, I want you to know, dude, you're awesome. I have nothing but respect for you. Thank you so much for coming to our school. Sal, only you can make this turn now. <laughs> you made this happen. Yeah. We love you, Sal. I would like to say... Um, you're probably one of my favorites on this show, and I would want to be pranked by you if I had the opportunity. <laughs> I would say to Sal that he's doing a really good job with the show and like with his own personal career, because he is his own person, separate from the show, and I like that because most people just kind of associate with him with only that. Like I'm pretty sure a lot of people here just think that it's going to be like an Impractical Jokers episode, but it's not. It's going to be his own thing, so I'm really... I'm not proud, but I'm proud that he can do this on his own. Um, if Sal was watching, I'd want to say thank you for being here. Clearly, there's a lot of people who are excited. Um, the line's reaching Ike now, I've, I've heard. So, um, yeah, thanks, Sal. <laughs> Filling all 836 seats in Kendall Hall, the fall comedy show was completely sold out. Sal's set was full of funny jokes and stories, providing TCNJ students with much-needed break from classes and studying. After the show, a group of lucky students were able to grab a pic with a star before he left campus. Thanks for watching. If you're interested in joining LTV News, email us at ltv at tcnj.edu. From all of us here at Lions Television, I'm Kelsey Haynes. See you next time.